Hello, my name is Louise Erdrich, and this is my book, La Rose. Tell us a little bit about how the different elements of your heritage affect your writing. Well, my mother is Ojibwe, Turtle Mountain Ojibwe, and that, so I am too. I belong to that band of Ojibwe or Chippewa people. But I'm also German-American, so I grew up really with these two sides of my family, and they managed to find an amazing balance. I mean, they've been married 62 years. Wow. Yeah, they're really my main literary influences. Tell us about La Rose. What is this book about? A man accidentally kills the child of his best friend, and in his Ojibwe tradition, decides that he has to make some sort of reparation to restore some balance in the community. So he gives his child, who is also the same age, five years old, right. to his friend's family. It's a very old form of making harmony and bringing um, a sort of resolution to something as tragic as what happened. The natural world, trees, mm -hmm. animals, is the environment something that is on your mind a lot? It's always on my mind, mm -hmm. yes. And it's not only because this is my background. Right. We sit here in this beautiful setting listening to birds, and this is really the way it should be. We, right. love, we love the world we live in. I have to admit, I, I hesitated when, it, when this first came out and we first started getting galleys of the book. I thought, right. I don't know if I can do this. This is just an unbearably sad concept. Read past page six, it gets better. So, <laughs> yes. I didn't want to write that beginning. Right. But it happened so quickly, it, it overtook me. Really, I couldn't stop writing this story. Right. There's a lot of heartache in it, right. but it's also very funny. I mean, there's, oh, there's, there's fantastic a humor in here. That's how life is, really. Right, you know, right. Li life has its extremes, right. and this is an extreme, but then life is ongoing. And mm -hmm. so how do these two families find good in what happens? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you, Mary Laura. It's been a pleasure. And thank you for joining us for A Word on Words. I'm Mary Laura Philpot. Keep reading. Let's talk about your bookstore. You know what? Yeah. We're okay. Good. People yeah. are always surprised. I know. You know, when you say the bookstore is doing great, people, they always have that little head tilt, like, how's the bookstore? They store? do. Don't, yes. You go, champ. Try to hang in there, you <laughs> yeah. anachronism, you. Right. Yeah. <laughs>